Okay, you stay here. Beyond this door, the hallways and chambers are flooded with radiation. I'll get the case and bring it right back. Keep your eyes open. Many of my lesser-minded brethren are bound to stumble across us. As promised, yeah, here's the geck. I hope it's worth it. Uh, I'm afraid this is where you and I part company. I'll find my way out of this place. Don't worry. Maybe we'll meet again somewhere in the, the wasteland.
What are you looking at? Objective is secured, sir. Good work, soldier. Make sure the Gek is secured aboard my Vertibird. Yes, sir. I'll have the text come down and remove it immediately, sir. You're certain he's unharmed? Yes, sir. He'll pass out shortly, but we can revive him. Excellent. Prepare him for transport immediately. Right away, sir. So, you're awake. Let's keep this nice and simple. You're going to tell me the code for that purifier, and you're going to tell me now. I'll tell you what's going on here. You lost. The good guys won this one, and now we're just wrapping up loose ends. We've got the purifier, now we just need the code to start it. You're going to give me that code now, and save us all a lot of trouble. Maybe I'll even let you go. So how about it? I'm waiting. Very well. We'll just verify that now. This is Colonel Autumn. Are your men in place, soldier? Your code is 704. Repeat. 704. Confirm and enter. Copy. 704. Stand by, sir. Entering code now. Negative, sir. The code's no good. I just lost another man. Why do you insist on making things difficult? Maybe I should start shooting. How much blood you think you can afford to lose before you tell me what I want to know? Mr. President, I have no time for other matters. I'll be with you shortly. Now, Colonel. Yes, sir. Ah, alone at last. I do apologize for Colonel Autumn's attitude. He's been under a great deal of stress lately. No doubt that you know who I am. I'm sure you've heard my radio broadcasts. I'd like to have a word with you face to face. I think there are a few things that you and I should discuss. You'll find your possessions in the locker near the door. I'll unlock the way for you. And I'll unlock your restraints as well. I'll be waiting for you in my office. Please don't carry.
Hold it right there. You're supposed to be in that holding cell. You're not going anywhere. There's a full complement of guards in the next room. As soon as I get them, you're going back to your cell. In a body bag, if necessary. Uh... You are? I, I mean, uh, Wood? Just make sure he knows I was real strict with you, okay? And that I didn't have my uniform on backwards this time. Hey there. Bye. Attention to all Raven Rock personnel. This is your president speaking. I've invited our guests from Vault 101 to my office. Please do not impede his progress. Quite well for yourself. Thank you for your cooperation. Then go do it. Get away from me.
Hey there.
rut? They're not who they say they are. Get out while you can, before they get you too.
high time we met. I'm quite pleased you were able to make it. The trip was not what I had intended, but serves as an adequate test of your abilities. You're too kind. The pleasure is mine, I assure you. I've been anxious to make your acquaintance for some time. You and I have much to discuss, my young friend. You and I have a chance to make our country a better place for all of us. I'd like you to make sure that chance isn't wasted. Understand I am placing a great deal of trust in you. Your simple presence here proves that. Just what I needed to hear. What I'm gonna ask of you may seem a bit... disturbing. I assure you, there's a very good reason for it. I'd like to explain what I want you to do. Will you indulge me for a moment? The good people of this country cannot regain control while mutation runs rampant through our land. My soldiers cannot stem the tide, nor can the cult you've come into contact with, this Brotherhood of Steel. Mutations like the super mutants and ghouls must be purged from our society, our world, before we can proceed anew. Where others have failed, I believe your father's work can succeed. Purifier your father helped create has the ability to provide clean water to the whole of this capital wasteland. With a simple modification, it can be used to distribute agents that destroy mutated creatures upon ingestion. In time, we could eliminate all mutations in the wasteland. At the same time, the good people of the world regain their health. I need you to make the modification necessary for this to succeed. In front of you will be a vial of modified FEV virus. It can be inserted into the control console for the purifier. Doing so will inject it into the water supply and the purifier will take care of the rest. You just need the code to activate the purifier. Simple. Isn't it? I understand. It's an unusual request. One I wouldn't make if it weren't of the utmost importance. Please understand that I cannot allow you to leave until you've taken the vial. And why would I do that? When I'm clearly the best hope for the people of the wasteland. What alternative would you suggest? Without the Enclave, what will the world do? Yes, I suppose it is. Very well. You shall have your wish. Once you've left, I'll put an end to the Enclave. I cannot stop Colonel Autumn, however. That much will be up to you. I suppose, then, that this is goodbye. You'll have to see yourself out. I have preparations to make. 